Well, the Ole Miss Rebels get their season back on track after dropping two of their last three games and a slow start in the first half in Saturday's game against the Oklahoma Sooners. The Rebels bounced back in the second half and came away with a win. Ole Miss took advantage of a struggling Sooners offensive line, sacking Oklahoma quarterback Jackson Arnold nine times. It was good to have a lead and make it two. We've been in that position with both our losses with the ball. I had one score and not pushing it to two scores because when you push it to two, now they got to throw more and now our pass rush can come alive. It, it feels amazing, you know what I'm saying? We work, we work it day in and day out, a whole bunch of walkthroughs, a lot of meet, a lot of time, meeting times. So whenever we get into the game and it pays off, it, it feels just, just great. And I feel like we're showing how great our D-line is. Rebels quarterback Jackson Dart finishes his day 22 of 30 for 311 yards with a touchdown. All that without the team's best receiver in Trey Harris. The games that we've lost, like we've been the ones to hurt ourselves. So um, I felt like there hasn't been a better team than us on the field, um, especially when we go back and watch the tape. But, you know, I think that Coach Kibben hit it right on the head. Like we got to worry about ourselves and every 11 guy or all the 11 guys on the field got to worry about their individual jobs, getting that stuff done, uh, playing and play out. Every play is independent. And uh, I'm glad that how we were able to rally and kind of have that be our main focus, especially in that second half. Ole Miss now shifts their focus to their road contest against the Arkansas Razorbacks next Saturday. Final from Vaughn Hemingway Stadium, Ole Miss 26, Oklahoma 14. In Oxford, Patrick Talbot, WTOK News 11 Sports.